Hello everybody and welcome back to another World of Warships Blitz video. Uh, today, I'm going to go over the Black Charles Martel, which I just got last night. It's a great boat. I love playing the, Fr the French cruisers. Uh, for equipment, you can go with either turret traverse in the first slot, which, or uh, getting the main battery dispersion down a little bit more. Me personally, I prefer uh, turret traverse. Uh, in second slot, you can run acceleration or rudder shift, steering gear mod one. Um, personally, I prefer acceleration and save that steering gear mod for the third slot. <clears throat> like I said, you'd say you'd run steering gear mod two pretty much without it. You're not going to turn very well in a French cruiser. <laughs> uh, I've also seen people just build it for straight speed. And this thing can get up to like 42, 43 knots. Probably more than that. Um, <clears throat> now the reason... So pretty much you can either run... You can run whatever you want. Whatever you're comfortable with. These are just my... This is just what I use for equipment setup. Uh, see right here, you have six, six speed boosters. Uh, you can get up to 38 knots with my setup. Uh, the, like, without using the top speed slash acceleration or whatever it is for the elite bonus. I use the elite gun operator. So I get a lower reload time and better turret traverse. <clears throat> uh, as far as play style goes, unless you're being really aggressive like i'm going to end up being here just because it's a bot that's charging me it's the only bot on the enemy team um <clears throat> you want to stay bow on just because french cruisers don't really have any armor uh as far as like the different shell types go you have the usual ap and he um the ap is pretty good against cruisers um it can work against lightly armored battleships or if you just shoot directly at the bow of battleships the ap will work but for battleships and destroyers i would prefer using he but against cruisers i would use ap all day just because the ap is good enough to get those citadel hits Good enough to get you a decent amount of damage. The torpedoes are nothing really to write home about. Like they're there, they have good range. They're a little bit slower, but uh, and you only have three per side. The reload speed on the torpedoes isn't that bad, but the torpedoes themselves aren't very good. Like it's the same torpedoes basically from freaking tier six all the way to tier ten. Um. So yeah, we caught the captured this area. We're gonna go ahead and make our move into B. Uh, once again, B. this thing is speedy, but that, my first target here is a freaking Colorado. As you can tell, I'm just forgetting that I have a Let's rear turret, stop. which is what you usually want to do. Precisely Especially since activated. like basically two shots from a battleship and you'll die. <laughs> but we're gonna see how many fires we can start now since we switched to HE. I use the precise aim. Uh, I don't really care for precise aim just because it doesn't really make that much of a difference. Um, that's just my opinion. I I don't like it because you can still get unlucky with a with your dispersion even while using it. It's, it's just one of those things, you know, but, uh, I really enjoy playing the French Cruiser. Um, oh, yep, yep, there you go. You can hear the kids in the background. It wouldn't be a voodoo video without it. <laughs> so, so, uh, yeah, that's, pr that's pretty much it for this one. Uh, that's pretty much all I have to say as far as, like, tips, tricks, and whatever-wise. 
Um. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh. Uh, I guess we're just, you know, enjoy the rest of this uh, low quality gameplay here of me stealing a bunch of kills pretty much. <laughs> that poor monarch. I'm just stealing all those kills. I'm gonna, just, I'm gonna try and get there to be before he captures it, but I don't think I will. I'm pretty sure those two idiots that are way back there are gonna make their way back to B. So I'll get some damage back. I like how I also have six engine boosters and I only ever use like two at the most. Every now and then I use a little bit more, but. Anyway, we're gonna go hunting down these last two ships right here. It's a Brooklyn and a North Carolina. And there's the North Carolina right off the bat. Let's see if we can start a fire on them. I'll switch to AP because I actually want to go for this Brooklyn. Oh, yep, there we go. There's one fire. And he put it out. So now we're gonna go for, we're gonna go for this Brooklyn. He's just charging straight at me. He doesn't even realize I'm right here. Ooh, yeah, we got that citadel. Wow, this dude has zero awareness as to what the heck is around him right now, or he just doesn't care. But anyway, we took him out. But uh, yeah, now what we got left is just to take out this North Carolina. But before we do this, I'm gonna say uh, thank you guys for watching. Appreciate it. Um, I'm sorry I've been lacking on posting videos and streaming, but me and my wife are in the process of buying a house. So uh, yeah. I mean, if you want to keep watching these videos, you know, like, comment, subscribe, share with your friends, all that good stuff. But, uh, yeah, I mean, that's pretty much it for this one, guys. Uh, we're going to finish this off with 79,000 Iron Fortress MVP. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Now, I guess I'll uh, see you guys in the next video.